Well, it's time now to bring in our political panel, former New South Wales Liberal leader Kerry Chikovrovsky and former Labor advisor Bruce Hawker. They're about to duke it out again. <laughs> Before we get to that, are you guys going to the Women's World Cup, do you think? You will for sure, won't you? Do you, you know... You used to say you were a soccer mum when you were a politician. Yeah, but then I became a rugby mum. So, <laughs> so I'm a bit more... I'm going to the Rugby World Cup at the end of the year for the boys, but I will... Absolutely, there's a couple of things I've actually put my hand up for for the women's... What about soccer. you, Bruce? I'll definitely go. Yeah, I've yeah. been to the women's cricket, women's uh, rugby league. Looking forward to the women's soccer. It's going to be huge. Yeah. All right, let's get to politics now. How critical a decision is the new appointment of a Reserve Bank governor? And, Bruce, is a, is a bureaucrat like Jenny Wilkinson or Stephen Kennedy really what you want to see in the job? Well, uh, I've got to say that the current uh, incumbent has probably left a little bit to be desired and <laughs> I'm not sure whether you needed a bureaucrat in there or Madame Zelda to do the, uh, the fortune telling because she could have done a better job than Lowe did uh, when he decided you were that... You ready for this one. There wasn't going to be a... <laughs> well, I thought about it long and hard, mate, and, 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 and I'm thinking it's pretty hard for him to work out uh, a case to say that he... He's fit for the job when he didn't understand what was coming down the line with uh, interest rates. Yeah, I think it's, it really comes down to one comment, doesn't it, Kerry Chikorowski, the reason that Phil Lowe has to go? Well, I think the interesting part about it is the uh, people who are out there commentating, suggesting that the last thing they need is another bureaucrat, that the fact that they need someone in the real world who's actually got some experience of the real world. Now, I'm not quite sure how many economists have experience of the real world either, but you I got mean... got anyone in mind? Uh, no, look, I would, I would not even think about suggesting to... I mean, obviously, you need someone who's got, you know, a lot of intelligence and understanding of how the economy works, but I think the suggestion of getting someone outside the Canberra bubble... Um, because, you know, life in Canberra, as we all know, is not that I've lived there for very long, but we all know life in Canberra is a little bit different to the rest of the country. Well, that's the thing. It's a Sydney-based position and we're mm. talking about potentially two Canberra candidates. That's exactly so it's right. a reasonable point.